to Science Channel's Cosmic Dimension. Stay with us. Since the Big Bang, the universe has continued to grow and expand. To understand just how big it has grown, we need to take an imaginary spaceship ride from the Earth to the edge of the visible universe. Our nearest neighbor is the Moon, just a quarter of a million miles away. At the center of our solar system, 93 million miles away, is our Sun. After crossing the center of our solar system, we continue our flight beyond the orbit of the Earth. The next planet out is Mars. Beyond the orbit of Mars is the asteroid belt. A billion miles away is the giant outer planet Saturn almost a thousand times the size of Earth. As we leave the solar system, we would pass one of our earliest interplanetary explorers, Voyager 1, launched in 1977 and traveling at a mere 40,000 miles per hour. Proxima Centauri and Alpha Centauri, A and B, our nearest stars, are 25 million million miles away. Our solar system sits in the quiet suburbs of a spiral galaxy, the Milky Way, a star city containing over a hundred billion stars. Every star we can see in the night sky lies within our own galaxy. This is deep space. Out beyond the Milky Way, 10 million, million, million miles from Earth, is the next spiral galaxy, Andromeda. Even traveling at the speed of light, it would take two million years to reach here. Andromeda and the Milky Way form part of a small cluster of galaxies called the Local Group. But stretching out way beyond the Local Group are much greater clusters of galaxies. If it were possible to travel fast enough for long enough and reach the edge of the known universe, this is what we would see. Uneven clusters of galaxies, a pattern that was predetermined in the very first second of the Big Bang. This is as far as our spaceship can take us. We are now 50 billion trillion miles from Earth. This is where science ends and speculation begins. Astronomers may never see what lies beyond here. This is where the secrets of the universe are hidden. <laughs>